hi guys hi guys hello everyone welcome back to my channel guys welcome back to another video thank you so much for tuning in a very very welcome you guys if you're new here my name is pili de papra and you're welcome for tuning in don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel if you haven't subscribed and thank you so much for clicking to pili de papra's entertainment you guys so yeah let us get down to today's video because obviously when she don't know how to do it after so mizi and mohale you know the trend that those guys they can and trend why look na look na look so guys why i'm trying to look so i look them they look so i look so i knew obviously who would put some some me guys are too lengthy a tricky shock to a wow he lost a case um halim down so a lot is happening you guys as we know they were married and a lot happened when they got divorced and whatever and then it was said oh no they were never married oh no their marriage was never recognized good thing a lot was said you guys so a yeah, guys, it's all okay. Eh, they, these guys have been trending, guys. I'm talking about some of them. Some of them are wrong. I did my last video. Obviously, you know about some really huge wedding, okay? And then basically, why people were never married. Basically, to be like, oh, like guys. Try to convince us with some of these people who were never married. So we're so bored. We're looking at them flop online. So I. I that was something else. So you guys are uh, they were trending Uguti Mohale one against Uso Mizi. So he's all bagu in the one you wow so Mizi Mkango lost. He lost, he lost, he lost, he lost. You know, I knew me never very good Uso Mizi Uzo was an store as a state wins again. But I you know, online when things are happening a lot especially <laughs> things that are not true, they just trend like crazy. So I, I was waiting for Samis to say something, you guys. Now Zile Veruti is going to come and say something, and he did. So yeah, it was a long day for me. I couldn't wait to, to finish it, wake up the ending to just, you know, uh, discuss this one. Because I saw Samis issued a statement somewhere, somehow, uh, about... Um, you know, guys, this is what happened. It's not like I lost against Mohale. This is what happened. Yeah, to he just uh, dropped the case. Uh, which case again? Okay, let me just go here. Uh, go MTN News. Uh, I'm just going to read something for you. Over here, so Mizi and Mohale were not married despite hosting the grand <laughs> wedding. Okay, no, Uti, they were never married despite who's hosting Angelia grand wedding. And then um so was said, so Ms. Mtomo said uh the decision to withdraw the divorce comes after we and un, um unable to reach an agreement regarding the existence of the marriage. We had initially agreed that uh, a marriage existed but um oh dear god I have to go down. So oh, sorry you guys um on a positive note, a doctor, um, hey, am I reading? Huh? Guys, I just lost my reading. What happened? No, I was reading, then I just kind of read something else. Okay, 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 but Mohale later claimed that no valid marriage had taken place. So Mklong was saying that after consulting an expert on customary marriage, he later accepted that no valid customary marriage was entered into. He asked people to respect their privacy. I'm grateful that uh, the matter has uh, been resolved and that I can focus on the future. I hope that we can find a path towards healing and a resolution at the time of writing. Mutawu had not commented about the matter. So uh, I saw uh, you guys uh, somewhere, uh, this was with MTN News just re reporting for us, okay? I just want to go to some Ms. Mklongo's uh, statement. Ms. Bonilla somewhere, I think I saved it. Oh, it's quite, um, you know, like those small ways when you're reading, you need to sharp eyes. But anyway, I'm going to zoom. Let, us, let me see. Oh, guys, good morning. Let us just hope I'm going to manage to read this. This is some Ms. Mklongo's statement, you guys, that he issued after trending Uguti Mogai lost Pela against Usom Som. So so we issued this kind of statement you guys I'm gonna make sure I'm a slamming our Vulaga cool and just try to read because wow these ways are just so small like I'm gonna put it on my screen it's just you need your sharp eyes to read this one. But anyway let me just go in and read the statement from Somism Song okay in a press release okay um, I don't know if I must come to you. Okay, I'm just going to bring the phone closer to me because I really need to see. Okay. Press release. Okay. I became aware of the information posted in the media. Oh my. 
uh, I became aware of the information posted in the media and social media on 9 March 2023 regarding the divorce case between me and Mohale. Okay, I wish to state uh, the true fact regarding the withdrawal of the divorce action as much uh, of the information um, circulated is simply incorrect. Okay, and then we are going to get a matter Okay, Utiana, both Mohale and I were initially in agreement for a reduced volume. <laughs> this guy, <laughs> I'm recording, he's putting the volume on. So Uti, both Mohale and I were initially in agreement that we entered into a valid customary marriage. It is indeed Mohale who are in the first in correspondence between us stated that a valid customary marriage was entered into and that we were married in community of property. And then I issued a summons for divorce as this is the only manner in which a marriage can be legally uh, dissolved in uh, accordance, according, accordance with a South African law. Okay, like I said, the words are very small. Okay, I'm struggling to see. <laughs> okay, and then we initially agreed to enter into settlement negotiations in an attempt a uh, to end the um, to end the marriage uh, amicable. I never uh, wanted the matter to become uh, protracted and acrimonial. Acrimonial. Okay. And then uh, the decision to withdraw the divorce action comes after we were unable to reach an agreement regarding the existence of the marriage. We had initially agreed that a marriage existed, but Mohale later claimed that no valid marriage had uh, taken place. Okay. I obtained an opinion from an expert in customary law and um, after careful consideration, I have accepted that no valid customary marriage was entered into. The decision to withdraw the action avoids a protracted, costly and acrimonious, uh, I want to zoom, acrimonious, litigation, I guess, uh, proceedings, okay? As a result, the action for divorce has been withdrawn and the litigation in respect of uh, the divorce is now finalized. This means that no divorce proceedings will take place. Although I received legal advice suggesting that Mohale's disavowal dis of our marriage, um, come on, may have warranted an exception to the usual rule of the withdrawing party of paying legal costs. I opted to offer to cover the cost. The decision was influenced by the fact that uh, the case was still in uh, its early stages and the legal costs were relatively small, which made uh, pursuing the matter seem uh, unproductive. There is no court order to this effect. The matter that was never heard by a court. The matter was never heard by a court, and no court has considered the merits of the of the dispute and made a ruling on those disputes. Okay, I am grateful that the matter has been resolved and that I can focus on the future. I hope that uh, we can find a path towards healing and resolution. I respectfully ask for. Uh, that our privacy during uh, this uh, time of transition uh, be respected uh, sincerely as so easy. So, my eyes, <laughs> those words were so small. I needed glasses. You know me, guys, sometimes I've got eye problems and the lights. Oh, I needed glasses to read there. But anyways, you guys, that is a statement from Usomizi Mklongo after she was trending. He lost against Umukhali. So he's explaining exactly what happened and what is going to happen now. I'm just reading the thing. I don't know when it comes to marriages and stuff. It's not like I've been married before. When it comes to these customary laws and whatever, the liquor, I just don't know. I was just reading the statement from Uput Usom Som after trending you guys. So yeah, I mean guys, let us just hope uh, they are going to yeah solve everything. Like they are saying uh, they are asking for a privacy and the respect and the privacy, whatever, so that they can solve this matter. And Uzagalang as he is not arguing about anything. Usom Som since he said uh, he's supposed to pay all the liquor fees in Donut and he's just gonna pay. I said Uti Som Som 
you know, things like that. You guys, so let him just let, let them deal with the situation the way they know how. Not receive you guys. So this is so miserable. Explaining to us good ones again, rather than Tina, he's always busy. And just ha, ah, how do you know you? Oh, mochale, oh, muine. You know, so he was just trying to clarify with the guys. This is what happened. This is what's gonna happen. This is what I said. This is what mochale said. This is what the court decided. Eh, so you guys, yeah, thank you so much for watching, you guys. We were just, we just wanted to read uh, his, his statement, so means we could not read it because it's all we just came with the video. you guys, actually, so means lost against Umuhale. Umuhale wins over Usomiz, and yeah, wow, congratulations, Umuhale, congratulations, Utu Usomizum, hey. This is what's going to happen. This is what happened. This is what we're going to do. And I still like respect and privacy so that we can deal with this matter. I'm a cable can challenge whatever, whatever you know. Yeah, guys, like the video before you go. Subscribe to the channel. I'll see you again on my next upload. Bye.